हो बाकी फिश क्या सोच रहे चंद्रमा के बारे में कि ये तो बहुत सुंदर दिखने वाला एक दूसरा जलचर है <laughs> तो विदु न तु अमृतमय ही मून इज द सोर्स ऑफ अमृत और ऑल द रसाज इति तद्वत यद यदवा अनद मीनिंग जले प्रतिबिंबम चंद्रम यथा इति सो अमृतमय रिजर्वायर ऑफ नेक्टर एंड सोमो सोम मीन्स नेम फॉर द सन एंड प्रतिबिंबम सो इन द नाइट मून आई एड मेड सम मिस्टेक हाँ सोमो मंस मीन्स मून सो जले प्रतिबिंबम चंद्रम यथा इति तो प्रतिबिंब देखकर भी इन द नाइट टाइम वॉट इफेक्ट चंद्र इज क्रिएटिंग दैट इज नॉट नोन टू द फिशेस इन द वॉटर सो वेरी नाइस एनोलॉजी वी जनरली से और इंचार्ज ऑफ क्राइम डिपार्टमेंट एंट्रेस इन टू जेल एंड द क्रिमिनल्स दे थिंक दैट इज वन ऑफ अस बट हियर ऑफिशियल एग्जाम्पल शास्त्रीय एग्जाम्पल इज दिस This universe, with all its planets, is most unfortunate. I am Lokah Durbhaga, and even more, Nitaram Api. Unfortunate are the members of the Yadu dynasty because they could not identify Lord Hari as the personality of Godhead, any more than the fish could identify the moon. So, should I read, or someone wants to read? इसमें टाइम नहीं जाना चाहिए फास्ट होना चाहिए ताकि हम हाँ फास्ट एज फास्ट एज यू कैन उद्वल लेमेंटेड फॉर द अनफॉर्चुनेट पर्सन ऑफ द वर्ल्ड कुड नॉट रिकॉग्नाइज लॉर्ड श्री कृष्णा इन स्पाइट ऑफ सीइंग ऑल हिस्स ट्रांसेंडेंट गॉडली क्वालिटीज फ्रॉम द वेरी बिगनिंग ऑफ हिज अपीरेंस विद इन द प्रिजन प्रिजन बास ऑफ किंग कम्सा अप टू हिज मौशर अलीला ऑल दो ही एग्जीबिटेड हिज पर्टेंस इज एज सुप्रीम पर्सनलिटी गॉड हेड in the six opulences of wealth strength fame beauty knowledge and renunciation the foolish persons of the world could not understand that he was the supreme lord foolish persons might have thought him an extra extraordinary historical historic figure because they had no intimate touch with the lord but more unfortunate were the family members of the lord the members of the yadu dynasty who were always in company with the lord but were unable to recognize him as the supreme personality of godhead uddhava lamented his own misfortune also because Although he knew Krishna to be the supreme personality of Godhead, he could not properly use the opportunity to render devotional service to the Lord. He regretted everyone's misfortune, including his own. The pure devotee of the Lord thinks himself most unfortunate. That is due to excessive love for the Lord, and is one of the transcendental perceptions of viraha, the suffering of separation. It is learned from the revealed scriptures that the moon was born from the milk ocean. There is a milk ocean in the upper planets, and the Lord Vishnu, who controls the heart of every living being as Paramatma, resides as a Shiva Dakshay Vishnu. Those who do not believe in the existence of the ocean of milk, because they have experience of only the salt water ocean, should know that the world is also called Go, which means cow. The urine of a cow is salty, and according to Ayurvedic medicine, the cow's urine is very effective in treating patients suffering from liver trouble. such patients may not have any experience of cow's milk because milk is never given to liver patients but the liver patient may know that the cow has milk also although he has never tasted it similarly men who have experience only of this tiny planet where the salt water ocean exists may take information from the revealed scriptures that there is also an ocean of milk although we have never seen it from this ocean of milk the moon was born but the fish in the milk ocean could not recognize that the moon was not another fish and was different from them the fish took the moon to be one of them or maybe something illuminating but nothing more the unfortunate persons who do not recognize lord krishna are like such fish they take him to be one of them all the little extraordinary opulence strength etc the bhagavad gita confirms such foolish persons to be most unfortunate avajananti mamuna manushim tanam ashatam so prabhupa sin sight about milk ocean <laughs> you knew that westerners will have doubt about have ocean in which milk is the substance he has elaborated and systematically proved it exists this 
your in example huh? <laughs> very nice in your that analogy book also i think it is there handbook students handbook me example person suffering from liver problem cannot appreciate milk <laughs> yes <laughs> okay going ahead so why they could not understand krishna was there any uh, gyan sadhan ki kami thi instrument for getting faculties for getting knowledge wo kam tha isliye they couldn't understand krishna but waisi baat nahi thi <laughs> so here ingitagya puru praudha एका रामास्त सर्वे भूता वासम अमम सत सो ऑल द यदूज यदवहा जो पहले श्लोक में क्या क्या शब्द आए थे यदवहा इज द प्लूरल तो उसके लिए यदवहा उनका एडजेक्टिव क्या है इंगित इंगित करना जस्ट हिंट दो बोलने के लिए कुछ एक दो सेंटेंस चालू करो आगे समझ जाएंगे क्या बोलना है उसको तो इतना शार्प इंटेलिजेंस था उनका इंगित पुरु प्रौढ़ा फ्री ओल्ड और एक्सपीरियंस्ड पुरु प्रौढ़ा ऑल वे डेमी गॉड्स हुक बर्थ इन यदु फैमिली एंड थर्ड एडजेक्टिव फॉर यदवा इज एका रामाश्च so at one place only they got everything ek jagah rehna ek jagah schooling ek jagah medicine ek jagah hospital nowadays family members or those who are married they prefer such a place where all facilities are available available nearby for yadus it was actual like that eka ramas ch satvataha so satvataha for yadus ke liye adjective सो so, सर्व भूतावासम सो लॉर्ड्स दिस इज एडजेक्टिव फॉर लॉर्ड सो ऑल दो लॉर्ड इज प्रेजेंट इन ईच एंड एवरी लिविंग एंटिटी सर्वत्र वसतो इति विष्णु तो भूतावासम सो ही डज आवास इन एवरी लिविंग एंटिटी और ऑल द लिविंग एंटिटीज आर इन कृष्णा इन द यो माम पश्यति सर्वत्र सर्वम च मयि पश्यति रेफरिंग टू दैट सो ऑल्सो लॉर्ड इज लाइक दिस दे अंडरस्टूड कृष्णा टू बी सात्वताम वृषभम अमम सत सो दे कंसीडर्ड ही इज सात्वत और ही इज यदु ओनली बट देयर आर स्पेशल हैविंग स्पेशल ब्यूटी एंड स्ट्रेंथ बट ही इज वन ऑफ अस ओनली सात्वताम वृषभम श्रेष्ठ यदु अमम सत इज अ वर्ब they thought like that so therefore they are unfortunate shlok number 9 bhagya hinatvad eva na viduhu na tu jnan samagriya abhavad itiya so because of being unfortunate they don't know not because of uh, deficiency of faculties for getting knowledge jnan samagri abhavad na आह तो ये बताया गया इस श्लोक में इंगितम चित्तस्थम जानती थी इंगित ये शब्द का अर्थ क्या है सामने वाले व्यक्ति के चित्त में क्या चल रहा है ये तुरंत जानने वाले चित्तस्थम जानती थी इंगित तथा पूरा पूरा प्रौढ़ा का पूरा मीन्स पूर्व अतिशय न प्रौढ़ा निपुणा सो वेरी एक्सपर्ट पूर्व प्रौढ़ा एंड एक एक कान तो अगला जो वर्ड है क्या है वर्ड राघवरू एक हाँ एका रामास उसका विश्लेषण क्या है एक या एक स्थानी आरमंती इति एक ही स्थान पर रहकर आराम जिनको मिलता है ऐसे तथा एवं भूता अपि भूता नाम आवासम ईश्वरम संतम तो भूतान आम सभी प्राणियों का जो आवास है जिनकी एनर्जी में ही सभी प्राणी रहते हैं 
तो ऐसा होते हुए भी सात्वता मृषभम इन सात्वत श्रेष्ठम अमन्यंत तो उन्होंने भगवान को सात्वता नाम यदुओं में श्रेष्ठ समझा भगवान है ये ऐसा नहीं समझा तो इसलिए तो जस्ट लाइक शारुम भट्टाचार्य को डोंट अंडरस्टैंड चैतन्य महाप्रभुज पोजिशन बिकॉज ही डिड नॉट रिसीव द मर्सी ऑफ द लॉर्ड सो वही पॉइंट इधर भी है द यदूज वेर ऑल एक्सपीरियंस्ड डिवोटीज लर्नड एंड एक्सपर्ट इन साइकिक स्टडी तो ये इंगित साइकिक स्टडी ओवर एंड अभाव दिस दे वेर ऑलवेज विद द लॉर्ड इन ऑल काइंड ऑफ रिलैक्सेशन एकाराम एंड स्टिल दे वेर एबल टू नो हिम ओनली एज द सुप्रीम हु डेवेल्स इन एवरीवेर तो जरा इधर थोड़ा डिफरेंस है नोटिस लॉर्ड रिजाइन एवरी वन एवरी वन बट यदूज अंडरस्टूड हिम टू बी वन ऑफ द बेस्ट यादवाज थोड़ा सा ट्रांसलेशन में फर्क है सोनार गौरंग प्रभु गॉट इट सम ऑफ देम हैव नॉट गॉट सागर गुरुआ प्रभु इज क्वेश्चनेबल फेस गॉट इट हाँ सो फ्रॉम द टी का लेटेस्ट सी द परपोर्ट वही ट्रांसलेशन का भाव परपोर्ट में आया है क्या नहीं देखते हैं इन द वेदास इट इज सेड दैट द सुप्रीम लॉर्ड और द परमात्मा कैन नॉट बी अंडरस्टूड सिंपली बाय द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ वन सीरोडिशन और पावर ऑफ मेंटल स्पेकुलेशन इंगित वो जो नायम आत्मा प्रवचन न लभ्यो न मेधसा न बहुना श्रुते न He can be known only by one who has the mercy of the Lord. The Yadavas were all exceptionally learned and experienced, but in spite of their knowing the Lord as one who lives in everyone's heart, they could not understand that He is the original personality of Godhead. So, is there a difference? Yes, huh? Mm. even that he is residing in every or all the living entities are resting place he is the resting place for all living entities so that they couldn't understand nahi nahi wo bhi sen parmatma bhi level par wo understand nahi kiya unhone They understood him to be only satvatam rishabham. Ah, best of the yadavas. To wo sarve bhut avasam. So we had Prabhupada has taken both the things that they know among sata. बट टीका में है ऑल दो ही इज लाइक दिस ही इज द बोर्ड ऑफ ऑल लिविंग इंडिटीज बट दे अंडरस्टूड टू मी एज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट याद वॉज ओके एनी वेज प्रभुपत का भर्जन आगे लेते बट दे कॉमन पॉइंट इज दे डिड नॉट अंडरस्टैंड कृष्णा टू बी द ओरिजिनल पर्सनैलिटी ऑफ गॉड इन दिस लैक ऑफ नॉलेज वॉज नॉट ड्यू टू देर इनसफिशियंट इरोडिशन इट वॉज सो न ज्ञान साधन अभावत it was due to their misfortune bhagya hinatva in vrindavan however the lord was not even known as the parmatma because the residents of vrindavan were uh, pure unconventional devotees of the lord and could think of him only as their object of love they did not know that he is the personality of godhead the yadu or the or the residents of dwarka however could know lord krishna as vasudev or the super soul living everywhere but not as the supreme lord so this is the common in both sridhar swami and prabhupad not as the supreme lord as the scholars of the vedas they verified the vedic hymns eko devah sarva bhuta adhishah antaryami and vrishni nam par devata 
the yadus therefore accepted lord krishna as the super soul incarnated in their family and not more than that so ye sarva bhutanam avas avasya utam ke liye abode hai okay next divasya maya ya srushta ye chanya asad ashritah भ्राम्यति धीर न तद्वाक्यर् आत्मनि उपतात्मनो हरो सो ऑल दिस आर कंसीडर्ड एज यदूज आर कंसीडर्ड एज ये और बिफोर दैट देवस्य माया स्पृष्टा हियर दिस बहुवचन so all those yadus are uh, being influenced or sparsh kiya hua bhagwan ki maya ki dwara sparsh hue aise yado aur anni ye ch anye asad aashrita ha so some of the relatives of lord krishna who were atheist shishupal ityadi to unko refer karte hue ye ch anye asad aashrita ha so both this type of personalities may try to influence devotees and try to convince that krishna is not supreme lord he is best of the yadus or like that he is parmatma only he is not supreme but uh, who will not get disturbed so tad vakye hi tad refers to ye dono ki vakyon ke dwara shabdon ke dwara tad vakye hi atmani हरो उप, उप्त आत्मन तो जो भगवान हरि में या परमात्मनी जिनकी बुद्धि लगी हुई है वो न भ्राम्य थे वो भ्रमित नहीं होंगे तो जिनका हृदय हमेशा भगवान में लगा हुआ है तो सततम कीर्तयन तो मां वो उनका ही बुद्धि ये दो टाइप के लोग भ्रमित नहीं कर पाएंगे so indirectly yuddha with saying that meri bhi buddhi ye log bhramit nahi karenge to wo ye point actually tika mein sidhar swami likhte hain ye ke api bhagyavant ha to kon bhagyavant hai bhagyavant ha tam ingita aadi aadi आदीन ईश्वरतया जानंतो तो जानंतो अपी तद विदाम प्रवृत्तिया वा मुहे यू तो जो जानते हैं उनकी जो चेतना है या जो अंडरस्टैंडिंग है फेथ है वो डिस्टर्ब नहीं होगी कुछ लोगों की होगी कुछ लोगों की नहीं होगी तो किन की नहीं होगी तो उसका विश्लेषण किम भाग्य वत्तया अपी तत्रह तो कौन भाग्यवान है यह दूसरे भाग्यवान नहीं है तो कौन भाग्यवान है तो देवस्य थी श्लोक की शुरुआत इससे हो रही है ये यादवा देवस्य माया सृष्ट व्याप्त तो भगवान की माया के द्वारा ये प्रभावित है यादव अयम अस्मद बंधु इति वदंती यादव युद्ध लोग बोलते कि ये तो हमारे भाई ही है ये च शिशुपालादय असद अन्य वैरम आश्रिता निंदंती तो शिशुपाल इत्यादि ये रिलेटिव्स ही थे लेकिन ये असद आश्रिता थे और निंदा करते थे तेषाम वाक्य ही तो उनके वाक्यों के द्वारा शब्दों के द्वारा आत्मनि हरो उप्त या उप्त आत्मन निक्षिप्त चित्त तो जिनका चित्त भगवान में लगा हुआ है ऐसे मादृश से मेरे जैसे बुद्धि ही न भ्राम्यते मोहम न प्राप्यते अन्य तो मूढ़ा ये तो जिनकी बुद्धि भ्रमित हो जाती है इन दोनों टाइप के लोगों के वाक्यों से सो दे आर फुलिश तो अंडर नो सर्कमस्टेंसेस कैन द वर्ड्स ऑफ पर्सन बिविल्डर्ड बाय द इलूजरी एनर्जी ऑफ द लॉर्ड डिवेड द इंटेलिजेंस ऑफ दोज who are completely surrendered souls 
Lord Sri Krishna is the supreme personality of Godhead according to all the evidences of the Vedas. He is accepted by all Acharyas, including Sripad Shankaracharya. But when he was present in the world, different classes of men accepted him differently and therefore their calculations of the Lord were also different. Generally, persons who had faith in the revealed scriptures accepted the Lord as he is and all of them merged into great bereavement when the Lord disappeared from the world. In the first canto, we have already discussed the lamentation of Arjuna and Yudhishthir to whom the disappearance of Lord Krishna was almost intolerable up to the end of their lives. The Yadavas were only partially cognizant of the Lord, but they are not but they are also glorious because they had the opportunity to associate with the Lord who acted as the head of their family and they also rendered the Lord intimate service. The Yadavas and other devotees of the Lord are different from those who wrongly calculated him to be an ordinary human personality. Such persons are certainly bewildered by the illusory energy. They are hellish and envious of the Supreme Lord. The illusory energy acts very powerfully on them because in spite of their, their elevated mundane erudition, education, such persons are faithless and are infected by the mentality of atheism. They are always very eager to establish that Lord Krishna was an ordinary man who was killed by a hunter due to his many impious acts in plotting to kill the sons of Dhritarashtra and Jarasandha, the demoniac kings of the earth. Actually, this is given in Vijana Chakravati Thakur's Tika. So those who are Anye Asad Ashritaha. So here is Vishwana Chakravati Thakur. Tenth sloka number ten. Hmm, yeah. So here Shariram Paritaja Vaikuntam. So uh, Anyat Shishta Siddhanta uh, uh, Siddhanta Aparamati Dushta Mat. Matam Asuram Ashritaha Tisham Vakyehi Kya Kya Vakyehi Krishnam Shariram Paritejya Vaikuntham Gataiti Krishna Sharitaka Vaikuntha Gay Tatha Krishna Dhutarashtra Jara Sandhadi Maha Maha Raja Drohad Dharma Janitena Brahma Shapena Sakula Eva Nasham Praptaiti Ninda To Dhutarashtra Jara Sandhadi Tadi Maha Maha Raja Drohad Dharma Janitena और ब्राह्म ब्राह्मण ब्राह्मण के शाप के द्वारा भी तो जो त्यक्तवा सुदुस त्यज सुरेपसित राज्य लक्ष्मी धर्मिष्ट आर्य वचसा तो आर्य वचसा कृष्ण को भी किसी ब्राह्मण ने शाप दिया था तो दैट इंसिडेंट इज नॉट टोल्ड बट हियर इट इज अपीयर्स दैट इट इज देयर समवेयर महाभारत में कहीं होगा तो ब्रह्म शापेन सकुल एव नाशम प्राप्ति ति निंदा भाषित ही हरो आत्मनि परमात्मनि उप उपतमानः निक्षिप्त चित्तस्य भक्तजनस्य धी न भ्रामिति तो ये दो मुद्दे प्रभुपाद इस राइटिंग इन हिस टीका एस इट इस सच पर्सन्स हैव नो फेथ इन द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ द भगवदीता दैट द लॉर्ड इस अन अफेक्टेड बाय द रिएक्शंस ऑफ वर्क नमाम कर्माने लिम्पंति अकॉर्डिंग टू द एथिस्टिक being cursed by the Brahmanas, I think Samba referred Sam ne ajo aparad kiya. Narad Muni ko pucha hai, ye Sam ke pet mein kya hai. So it refers to that Dharmishta Arya Vajasa. All the sins committed by Krishna in killing the sons of Dhritarashtra, all these blasphemies do not touch the heart of the devotees of the Lord because they know perfectly well what is what. Their intelligence regarding the Lord is never disturbed, but those who are disturbed by the statements of the Asuras are also condemned. That is what Uddhav meant in this verse. <laughs> Pradarsh, pradarsha tapta tapasam Avitrupta drishtam nunam 
ಆಧಾಂತರಧಾತ್ಯಸ್ತು ಸ್ವಿಂಬ ಲೋಕಲೋಚನ ಐಸೆ ಜೋ ಹರಿ ಉನ್ಕಿ ಮಾಯಾ ಸೇ ಸಬ್ ಯದು ಭ್ರಮಿತ ಹೋಗೆ ತೋ ಎಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಹೈ ಕೈಸೆ ಕಹ ಸೌ ಹರಿ ತೋ ಎಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಪರ್ಸನಾಲಿಟಿ ಕೈಸಿ ಹೈ ತೋ ಯಾ ಪರ ಯಬ್ದ ಹೈ ಆದಾಯ ಅಂತರ್ಧಾತ್ ಯು ಸ್ವಿಂಬ ಲೋಕಲೋಚನ ತೋ ಯೋ ಸ್ವಿಂಬ ನೃಣಾಂ ಅತಪ್ತ ತಪಸಾ ಅವಿತೃಪ್ತ ದೃಶಾಂ ಪ್ರದರ್ಶ ಜೋ ಸ್ವಯಂ ಕೆ ರೂಪ ಕೋ ಸ್ವಿಂಬ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ಕೋ ನೃಣಾಂ ಕೈಸೆ ಮನುಷ್ಯ ಅತಪ್ತ ತಪಸಾ ತೋ ಜೋ ಸಫಿಶಿಯಂಟ್ಲಿ ತಪಸ್ಯಾ ಕರ್ ಕರ್ ಪ್ಯೂರಿಫೈಡ್ ನೈ ಹೋ ಅತಪ್ತ ತಪಸಾ ಓರ್ ಅವಿತೃಪ್ತ ದೃಶಾಂ ದೇ ವೇರ್ ನಾಟ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ಲಿ ಸ್ಯಾಟಿಸ್ಫೈಡ್ ಬೈ ಸೀಂಗ್ ದ ಲಾಡ್ ದಿ ಸಾವ್ ದ ಲಾಡ್ ಫೈವ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ಟೆನ್ ಮಿನಿಟ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಫ್ಯೂ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಸಮ್ ಆಫ್ ದೆಮ್ ಕುಡನ್ ಸೀ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಬಟ್ ಹಿ ಆರ್ ಟಾಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಲಾಡ್ ಗೀವ್ ದರ್ಶನ್ ಸ್ವಿಂಬ ನುನಾಮ್ ಪ್ರದರ್ಶ ದಿಖಾಕರ್ ಕ್ಯಾ ಕಿಯಾ ಉನ್ನೆ ಅಂತರ್ಧಾತ್ ಯಾ ಅಂತರ್ಧಾತ್ ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಅಂತರ್ಧಾತ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಹಿ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರ್ಡ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಬೈ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರಿಂಗ್ ಸಡನ್ಲಿ ಇನ್ ದಟ್ ವೇ ವಾಟ್ ಹಿ ಡಿಡ್ ಲೋಕ ಲೋಚನ ಆದಾಯ he uh, literally or figuratively took away pradaya means dena adaya means lena kisko le liya loka lochanam logon ki lochan hi unhone le liye because people lost the sight of the person the beauty which they wanted to see for long time but suddenly the lord disappeared so tika for sloka number 11 correct to thoda sa aage hi hai pradarsha atapta tapasam to kah asau harihi iti apekshayam ah to jo hari jinki maya ne sab ko ye kiya bhumit kiya to wo kaise hari pradarshayiti na taptam tapah yaihi तो तपस्या से जो शुद्ध नहीं हुए कम तपस्या की है ऐसे थोड़ी की है लेकिन सफिशियंटली नहीं तो यही अतः अवितृप्त दृश्य तो देर फोर दे वे नॉट फुल्ली सेटिस्फाइड बाय सींग द लॉर्ड अवितृप्त दृशो या दृश्य येषाम तेषाम स्वबिंब स्वबिंब का मीनिंग क्या है स्वमूर्तिम स्वयं का रूप ಏತಾವಂತಂ ಕಾಲಂ ದರ್ಶಯಿತ್ವಾ ತೋ ಕುಚಿ ಸಮಯ ತಕ್ ಉನ್ನೆ ದಿಖಾಕರ್ ಯಹ ಅಂತರ್ಹಿತವಾನ್ ಹಿ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರ್ಡ್ ಲೋಕಸ ಲೋಚನ ಆದಾಯ ಆಚ್ಛಿದ್ಯ ಲೋಗೋ ಕಾ ಲೋಚನ್ ಆಯಿಸ್ ಆದಾಯ ಕಾ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ಯಾ ಹೈ ಆಚ್ಛಿದ್ಯ ಸ್ನ್ಯಾಚ್ಡ್ ಲಿಟ್ರಲಿ ಲೇಕಿನ್ ಟು ಕವೆ ತಾದೃಶಸ್ಯ ಅನ್ಯಸ್ಯ ಲೋಕ ಕಮನೀಯ ಅಭಾವಾತ್ ತೋ ಇನ್ಕಿ ಜೈಸಾ ಕಮನೀಯ ಸುಂದರ ಕೋ ಹೈ ನೈ ತೋ ಇಸ್ ಭಾವ ಸೆ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಉನ್ಕಿ ಆಖಿ ಲೆ ಲಿ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರ್ ಹೋ ಕೆ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹೂ ಮ್ಯಾನಿಫೆಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಇಟರ್ನಲ್ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಬಿಫೋರ್ ದ ವಿಜನ್ ಆಫ್ ಆಲ್ ಆನ್ ದ ಅರ್ಥ ನುನಾಮ್ ಜೋ ಪಹಿಲೆ ಲೈನ್ ಮೇ ಆಯ್ತೆ ಶಬ್ದ ಪರ್ಫಾರ್ಮ್ಡ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಡಿಸಪಿಯರೆನ್ಸ್ ಅಂತರ್ಧಾತ್ by removing his form from the sight of those who were unable to see him as he is due to not executing required penance in this verse the word avitrupta drisham is most significant the conditioned souls in the material world are all trying to satisfy their senses in various ways but they have failed to do so because it is impossible to be satisfied by such efforts the example of the fish on land is very appropriate if one takes the fish from the water and puts it on the land it cannot be made happy by any amount of offered pleasure the sweet soul can be happy only in the 
association of the supreme living being the personality of godhead and nowhere else the lord by his unlimited causeless mercy has innumerable vaikuntha planets in the brahma jyoti sphere of the spiritual world and in that transcendental world there is an unlimited arrangement for the unlimited pleasure of the living entities the lord himself comes to display his transcendental pastimes typically represented at vrindavan mathura dwarka he appears just to attract the conditioned souls back to godhead back home to the eternal world but for want of sufficient piety a tapta tapasa the onlookers are not attracted by such pastimes of the lord in the bhagavad gita it is said that only those who have completely surpassed the way of sinful reaction can engage themselves in the transcendental loving service of the lord eshtam pantagatham papam jananam punya karma the entire vedic way of ritualistic performances is to put every conditioned soul on the path of piety by strict adherence to the prescribed principles for all orders of social life one can attain the qualities of truthfulness control of the mind control of the senses forbearance etc and can be elevated to the plane of rendering pure devotional service to the lord only by such transcendental vision are one's material hankerings fully satisfied when the lord was present persons who were able to satisfy their material hankerings by seeing him in true perspective were thus able to go back with him to his kingdom but those persons who were unable to see the lord as he remained attached to material hankerings and were not able to go back home back to godhead when the lord passed beyond the vision of all he did so in his original eternal form as stated in this verse the lord left in his own body he did not leave his body as is generally misunderstood by the conditioned souls so is antardhanat disappeared this word is important this statement defeats the false propaganda of the um, faithless non devotees that the lord passed away like an ordinary conditioned soul the lord appeared in order to release the world from the undue burden of the non believing asuras and after doing this he disappeared from the world's eyes so adaay to lok lochanam adaay ye connection hai so anyway ठीक है तो नाउ नेक्स्ट वन श्लोक आई थिंक यू कैन टेक यन्मर्त्यलीलोपैक स्वयोग माया बलम दर्शयता गृहीत विस्पन स्वस्य च सौभगर्धे परम पदम भूषण भूषणांगम तो हियर जो अभी स्वबिंबम के बारे में बात चल रही है तो यत रिफर्स टू सर्वनाम फॉर स्वबिंबम तो ये रूप कैसा था मर्त्य लीला औपयिकम ये पृथ्वी लोक पर लीला करने के लिए उपयुक्त मर्त्य लीलो पैकम और किससे प्राप्त किया था वो स्वयोग माया बलम गृहीतम स्वयं की योग माया के बल से जो धारण किया था तो उसको दर्शयता तो देखकर स्वस्य च यद स्वबिंबम दर्शयता स्वयं का ऐसा ये रूप और वो कैसा है सौभग गर्धी या सौभ सौभग और रुद्धि तो वेरी कंप्लीटली फिल्ड विथ ऑल द ऑपिलेंसेस सौभग रुद्धि है तो स्वस्य च विस्मापनम ही हिमसेल्फ बिकेम वेरी वंडरस्ट्रक सो दैट फॉर्म इज परम पदम सो हाइएस्ट अचीवेबल ऑब्जेक्ट टू बी सीन एंड हिज बॉडी भूषण भूषण आंगम his bodily limbs are the decoration for the other decorative items on his body 
not the other way around so decorative items are not beautifying his body but his body is beautifying the ornaments so is ka तदेव बिंबम वर्णयति त्रिभि वो स्वयं का रूप कैसा है तो वो वर्णन कर रहे तीन श्लोकों में उससे पहला ये ट्वेल्व थर्टीन फोर्टीन में से पहला यत मर्त्य लीला लीला स्वोप इकम तो योग्यम औपैकम तो लीला औपैकम औपैकम का अर्थ योग्यम स्वस्थ अपि विस्मय जनकम खुद को भी भगवान को भी वो विस्मय में डाल रहा है क्यों उसका सौभग गर्धे सौभाग्य अतिशयस्य वृद्धे अतिशयस्य परमम पदम पराकाष्ठा हाइएस्ट काष्ठा के लिए क्या बोलते हैं पराकाष्ठा फट एवर वन कैन इमेजिन टू बी द हाइएस्ट ब्यूटी भूषणाम या भूषणा नाम भूषणानी अंगानी यस्मिन तो जिनके लिम्स वेर एक्चुअल डेकोरेशन फॉर द ऑर्नामेंट्स ऑन द बॉडी तो प्रभुपत का ट्रांसलेशन द लॉर्ड अपियर्ड इन द मॉर्टल वर्ल्ड बाय हिज इंटरनल पोटेंसी स्वमाया या स्वयोग माया बलम गृहीतम यद मृत्यु लीला औपैकम योग माया ही केम इन हिज इटर्नल फॉर्म विच इज जस्ट सुटेबल फॉर हिज पास टाइम्स औपैकम योग्यम तो सुटेबल दीज पास टाइम्स वेर वंडरफुल फॉर एवरी वन इवन फॉर दोज प्राउड ऑफ देयर ओन ऑपुलंस इंक्लूडिंग द लॉर्ड हिमसेल्फ इन हिज फॉर्म एज द लॉर्ड ऑफ द वैकुंठ proud people is also included thus his sri krishna's transcendental body is the ornament of all ornaments so one of you can read the purport and then we'll stop in in conformity with the vedic hymns nityo nityana chetra chetrana Kata Upanishad 2 to 13 The personality of God is more excellent than all other living beings within all the universes in the material world He is the chief of all living entities no one can surpass him or be equal to him in wealth strength fame beauty knowledge or renunciation When Lord Krishna was within this universe he seemed to be a human being because he appeared in a manner just suitable for his pastimes in the mortal world He did not appear in human society in his vaikuntha feature with four hands because that would not have been suitable for his pastimes but in spite of his appearing as a human being no one was no one was or is equal to him in any respect in any of the six different opulences everyone is more or less proud of his opulence in this world but when lord krishna was in human society he excelled all his contemporaries within the universe when the lord's pastimes are visible to the human eye they are called prakata and when they are not visible they are called aprakat in fact the lord's pastimes never stop just as the sun never leaves the sky the sun is always in its in its right orbit in the sky but it is sometimes visible and sometimes invisible to our limited vision similarly the pastimes of the lord are always current in one universe or another and when lord krishna disappeared from the transcendental abode of dwarka it was simply a disappearance from the from the eyes of the people there it should not be misunderstood that his transcendental body which is just suitable for the pastimes in the mortal world is in any way inferior to his different expansions in the vaikuntha lokas his body manifested in the material world is transcendental par excellence in the sense that his pastimes in the mortal world excel his mercy excel his uh, mercy displayed in the vaikuntha lokas in the vaikuntha lokas the lord is merciful toward the liberated or nitya mukta living entities but in his pastimes in the mortal world he is merciful even to the fallen souls who are nitya baddha or conditioned forever the six excellent opulences which he displayed in the mortal world by the agency of his internal potency yog maya are rare even in the vaikuntha lokas all his pastimes were manifested not by the material energy but by his spiritual energy the excellence of his ras leela at vrindavan and his householder life with 16000 wives is wonderful even for narayan in vaikuntha 
and is certainly so for other living entities within this mortal world. His pastimes are wonderful even for other incarnations of the Lord, such as Sri Ram, Narsimha, and Varaha. His opulence was so super excellent that his pastimes were adored even by the Lord of Vaikuntha, who is not different from Lord Krishna himself. <laughs> so his pastimes are adored by Narayan <laughs> and not different from Lord Krishna himself. So Martya Lilo uh, Yogyam, the whole point Prabhupada is explaining in the purpose. So one last thing, this chapter has 38 slokas and we have 34, 34. So we have covered only 12 today and tomorrow we want to complete the chapter. So can all of you come for tomorrow's class at 11 a.m. and be here till 1.30. So online also, we can give the reply to you, Kalshan Prabhu. नहीं अभी प्रश्न तुम्हारो इलेवन अप्लाक हैं तो यू योर ओपिनियन टू योगल शाम प्रभु फ्राइडे